Hey YouTube, it's Lipbon Queen here. Just wanted to get on here today and I wanted to show you um, a few um, hauls I did today. Um, I went to a bunch of different stores and I just wanted to get on here and I wanted to um, make a video on here and show you what I got. Um, so first I went to Dollar General and um, uh, I picked this up for my kitchen. It is a uh, coffee clock and it says special blend and um, and it was on clearance for $7.20. And I was super excited to get this. And it takes two AAA batteries. So, pick some of them up. And um, I was excited to get this because I cannot wait to put that in my kitchen. It'll look so good. And then I went down the candle aisle and picked up the salted caramel marshmallow candle. And I love the little design on the side of the tin. But I just thought that was super cute. And it was a dollar. And it smells amazing. I can't wait to burn it. Smells so good. And then I picked up a little thing of body wash for my son. He, he thought it smelled really good and he liked it. So I picked him up that. And then I picked up this for my laundry. I picked up the 30 load Sun Triple Clean Clean and Fresh detergent. And then I picked up the fabric softener. Um, nothing exciting, just, you know, normal household needs. So I picked those up. And then the last thing I picked up at Dollar General was my son. Um, he wanted some of these. He saw them down the Halloween candy aisle. And he picked those up. He loves the Krabby Patties. So it's the gummy, colorful Krabby Patties. So I picked him a bag of those up. And that's all that I got at Dollar General. And then um, I went to, um, let's see. I went to Dollar Tree. And I didn't spend a lot in there. But, um, I did, um, I did get a few good things in, in here. Let's see. Okay. So I went to Dollar Tree. I didn't get a whole lot of stuff, but I went down the candy aisle, the Halloween candy aisle, when you first walk in. And, um, I found the Pop Rocks I've been looking for. The, uh, Pumpkin Patch Orange, um, Pop Rocks. Um... I found them, and I actually thought for some reason that they were like pumpkin flavored. They're not. They're orange or pumpkin, pumpkin patch orange. But they're still really good. I was super excited to find these. So I picked up that, and I picked up another pack, and then um, I tried them, as you can tell. And I, they really are good, so I was glad I finally found them. And then I picked up this because um, I couldn't find the actual shower gel, but uh Deb Anderson uses this stuff, like she said she loves this stuff, and she can't ever like find any more of it, and I happen to come across one bottle. I haven't been able to find this, but it's the Hawaiian Blossom and Plum Scented uh, Body Scrub from April Bath and Shower. I picked that up because where she's like, you know, like raved about it, I just knew that if she likes that I probably would too, because me and her have um, about the same taste and stuff, so... Um, and then I picked up a pack of these uh, AA um, Sunbeam Super Heavy Duty batteries for my um, for my clock I picked up at Dollar General because it takes the AA. So I picked up some of the AA's. And then um, I picked up something fun and exciting at Dollar Tree. And Miss Shorty 22 had posted a picture on Facebook about these and. Um, I was super excited I found them today. I wasn't even really looking for them. You know, I just come to the register and at the register where they got that little bin, you know, it shows like the little gums and candies and stuff. When I looked over the side, they had these, the Mexican jumping beans. And I was so excited to find these. Oh my gosh. I've not had Mexican jumping beans since I was like really little. And um, these things have been like over here just jumping and moving around. I don't know if they'll jump anymore now that I've got them on camera. But they're just so cute. I love the little picture in the background. It's like a little bean. And it says, um, Lorette Jane, I think is what it says. It's so cute. But these little beans, they've been like moving around like crazy all day long. I don't know if they'll do anything now. I'm trying to stay totally still. <laughs> they won't do anything. But if you keep them totally still, they start moving. I don't know. They're not doing anything. But um, 
they've been doing it all day. They've been like jumping around and everything since we got them. So, um, I just thought those were super cute, and I couldn't believe I found them. So I got me a pet. I got me this one, and I got my two boys um, each one because they were excited to see them. They had no idea what they were, and I thought that was cute. And then. After I left Dollar Tree, there's a Target right beside my Dollar Tree. So I went by Target and um, I happened to walk by where the Halloween candy was because my kids were like drawn to it. They were like looking at it. And then when I looked, I saw the, the new extra pumpkin spice seasonal edition like in the three pack. When I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, because I've been looking for it at Dollar Tree and could not find it. And because um, I've been sold out. And uh, it's three 15 stick packages. And. Um, it's the sugar-free pumpkin spice extra gum. So I was super excited to find this because, like I've said many times, I'm obsessed with anything pumpkin spice or anything pumpkin in general. So I'm so glad I found this. So if y'all if y'all are looking for this and can't find it at Dollar Tree, go to Target and go where the gum section is. And I think it's on sale for like $2.96. So you're actually saving a few cents, you know, buying it at Target with a three-pack. But I was super excited to get it. And um, then... I also picked up these here, which me and my kids have already got into. <laughs> We're impatient. Um, the M&M, the pumpkin spice M&Ms. But these things are so good. I don't really taste the pumpkin in them like you think you would. I don't know if it's just me, but my, my husband and my kids, they can taste the pumpkin. I can't taste the pumpkin in it. Um, I just, I don't know, I think just because I know that this pumpkin spice, I love them. But these things are really good, and, um, I really do like these pretty good. These things are moving now. Y'all probably think I'm crazy because they're not moving whenever... They won't move whenever I put them on camera. Maybe they're camera shy. You just never know. Um, then, where else did I go today? I've been to so many different places. Oh yeah, then I went to Ulta because Ulta is also beside my Target. Um, so, I had got, the only reason I went into Ulta was, um, got my little Ulta bag. The only reason I went into Ulta was because, um, I had received a coupon in the mail um, this week. I think it was Monday, and it it was a uh, ten dollars off any item in the store, or it can be used in store or online. And um, so I didn't want to pay shipping online, um, so I ended up just go ahead and getting something from the store. So I went in there and I went looking around. I had no idea what I was going to get, but I was super excited. I had got that credit to do that, so. Um, I told you before I like the Tree Hut brand stuff. Like um, I have that mango body lotion, and I really do enjoy it. And I'm almost done with it because it's in my things I must use up this month. And I've really been using it a lot, and I love it. So then I went down the aisle. And I thought, well, I'm gonna get the body scrub to go with it. Well, I started smelling the different body scrubs that Tree Hut makes, and I found this one called um, Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub, and it's a Brazilian nut. And um, this stuff right here is amazing. I am so excited I got this because, um, this stuff, it smells, it's super thick, which you can tell I've already used some of it, but this stuff smells so good. Oh my god, it almost smells like chocolate and coffee together. It's like a mocha, a mocha scrub or something. It smells, it smells so good. And you get 18 U.S. ounces and, um, and it's just amazing. That's all I can say about this product. I have never had a Tree Hut product that I haven't liked. Um, and I really do like it also. They don't test on anything on animals. And uh, it's made in the U.S. So, again, I'm trying to do this. Trying to get products that are made in the U.S. Um, I feel safer knowing it's made in the U.S. I don't know. I, I'm not totally against anything made anywhere else. But I'm trying to get more products that are, you know, from the U.S. But... Um, I was super excited to find it and this stuff's really amazing and it works really good it made me super soft after I used it um, in the shower so um, if y'all see that in your in your um, Ulta's or I think Walgreens carries Tree Hut and I think maybe Rite Aid maybe CVS I'm not sure but I do know Walgreens carries it 
Um, if you happen to see that kind of stuff, you know, just stop for a minute and smell some of the different scents that they have because I'm guarantee you'll find something that you like. And it's reasonably priced. That was, um, this scrub was only like $7.49, I think. And that should last me for a while, but it was only $7.49. I had a $10 credit. So, my mom had went with me and she was liking some kind of nail polish or something she saw. So, I ended up just getting the nail polish too to make it equal up to the $10. And then, um, that way, I didn't pay a dime for that. Nothing. Nothing at all. So, I was super excited and I love it. It smells so good. So, um, I just want to get on here and I want to show you my little shopping haul I did today. And, um, if there's anything in here that you may have liked or whatever, I hope that you find it in the stores that, you're, um, that you might go and look for it. And I will talk to you guys next time, and I hope you all have a great weekend, and I will see you guys later. Thanks. Bye.